What's going on, everybody? Welcome, welcome. And today, I want to answer a question I've been getting for a long time from one of my videos. Actually, my most popular video ever so far. And the question is simply, how do I join Freemasonry? Now, this came from a video that I did called, Why Did I Join Freemasonry? For those who don't know, yes, I'm a Freemason. Ooh, frig, get over it. And the question of how do I join is, I think, is my most asked question ever. So I just want to answer that question very simply in this video. Hopefully, this will be a sufficient answer for people so they, they can finally get the answer that they want. All right. It is very simple. Basically, all you need to be is the proper age between 18 and 21 depending on where you are, um, in good standing, meaning you ain't got nothing crazy going on with you, you know, something like really, really illegal, bad stuff happening with you. And you have to do it, under, you have to ask and do it of your own free will in the court, meaning you're not forced or coerced to join it. You, wanna, you join because you want to. Simple as that. Now, when people ask me, how do I join? I always say, well, this is what you do. Wherever you live, wherever you live, you find a lodge that is closest to where you live. Simply because of proximity. It's easy to get to, no real hassle. Don't cost a lot to get there, all that stuff. You can walk there, whatever. You find a lodge in your proximity. And since we since we in the day of no technology, you can go, you can find the name of the lodge, go online, find the email address, because nowadays, I think every, every lodge guy has an email address now. It's all, it's all technology now. It's all computer, right? So you go online, you find the email address, the website, the telephone number, and street address for that particular lodge, and you simply contact them. It's that simple. You simply contact them. You can do it via email, telephone number, whatever is going on, right? It's that simple. And for me, personally, for personal experience, what I did was I, since the laws that I did join, at the time we lived very close to, we could walk there, actually. So all I really had to do was just find the email address and just send them an email. And it got back to me, and the rest is history. But you know, if it's a little, if it's a little farther than walking, you can, so you can go online, find the email address, find the street address, find the telephone number, and you can make contact with them that way. Okay. But you have to be of proper age, like I said, eighteen to twenty-one, depending on where you are, because certain places have different ages. Age between eighteen and twenty-one. Okay. You know, it have be good standing, meaning you can't nothing crazy, really, really bad stuff going on with you, like legal stuff like that. You know, you ain't got like the cops on your neck like that. You know, you can't have that. And also, you have to do it under your own free will and accord. Simply meaning, you're doing it because you want to, not because someone is telling you to or forcing you to. You saying to yourself, okay, I want to do this. I'm going to go through the steps. I'm going to go through the get the steps to doing that because I want to. No one's forcing me to. And then you just make the make the proper connections that I just mentioned, and you ask. They will say to be one, ask one. Well, that's part of it. It's finding information. It's finding the address, finding the phone number, finding the email address, and then making those connections. That's the asking part. Now, once you do that, and you make contact with the person. Then anything else is up to that particular lodge. And, you know, everybody has their own individual set of rules and stuff that, you know, that they have their own. And they'll let you know that. And then you go from there. That's all. It's the interview process. And they ask you questions. And then you go from there. And th there's a fee. There's a fee for it. There's an missions, missions, missions fee or missions fee. And that's it. 
It's really that simple. This is not a whole lot of hoopla, not, nothing really crazy going on. It's that simple. So that's how you do it. Step one, are you of proper age? Step two, do you have good standing in the community? You ain't got nothing crazy going on, nothing legal, nothing, nothing crazy like that. And three, are you doing this of your own free will in the court? And like I said, to make it easier on yourself, find a lodge that's closest to where you live. Proximity, you know, it's, e- it's easy to get to. It's all about proximity, easy to get to. And you find that lodge. You go online, because like I said, it's the 21st century. Everything's online now. Look up the information. Find the contact information and contact them. And then once the contact has been made, the communication has been going back and forth, you go from there. It's that simple. All right? So hopefully, this video has answered any that, that, that question that I get all the time. How do I join Freemasonry? It's that simple. Okay? Really, really is that simple. Hope this video has informed you all well. And those who want to join, just take those steps and you should be good. I'll catch you all later. Peace. Mm-hmm. <laughs>